BPM is uh, the full form of BPM is business process management. Uh, this tool is designed for the business flow and uh, uh, using these objects with the low code. Low code is in the sense uh, the coding part much will not be there in the appian tool as much limited and we will be familiar with the coding. Okay, this technology automates uh, like you know monitor business process from beginning to end. And why we have to use this BPM? Uh, uh, generally, BPM can design a business flow as earlier as I said uh, before that, and with the low code, and it takes less time to design the entire application. What we are doing in, in our project, and it is a cost effective. And BPM is not only uh, not only can improve the profitability, uh, it can also like you know the platform technology and organization can rapidly develop and deploy the uh, custom business applications. Uh, among these technologies, we have Java, Python, and so and so languages. Uh, the why we have to make use of this the question, uh, uh, Nami. Uh, sorry to interrupt. So, do we need to have yeah, yeah. Uh, like a Java background? Uh, any background needed for uh, in tools the technologies we should be knowing before before getting into APN? Is there any mandatory uh, technology uh, we should be aware of or we should have hands on experience on? Yeah, just like you know, the there is no need of uh, an experience on languages. The directly you can go, you can learn the Appian. It is entirely different language in the Appian tool. Uh, here the main advantage is like you know, in languages they they will be having the separate uh, coding, but in Appian uh, having the separate coding, where there will be no matching of these languages. Here uh, BPM tool Appian has its own type of uh, coding language. Okay. Okay. Okay, why we have to make use of this BPM? BPM is nothing but like you know, as in, as earlier mentioned, as earlier I have mentioned that it is a business process management where we can use uh, where we can use the less we can use less code in this uh, API and we can integrate with the uh, other systems like you know uh, Android and uh, Java. We we can integrate our application with uh, Java and Android with uh, user friendly to make our application. Well, uh, now I'm going to say about Appian. What is Appian? What exactly this is? Appian, uh, like, you know, uh, nowadays in Appian, uh, we have many tools like Pega, uh, Appian, and Commander, these all. Among these, Appian is, a, uh, in the market, it is a BPM innovation and delivering and flexible and easy to solutions needs for the business, okay? In governments and worldwide. Appian is a local, uh, a development platform and it designed for the business of all the sizes and nowadays the companies are most probably using this appian technology okay and uh, it enables uh, users to build the process management applications welcoming to the appian uh, as mentioned uh, as earlier i mentioned it is a local platform and allows uh, all the users to automate complex processes and create uh, like you know uh, custom apps which can be deployed on any devices and like uh, Nani, and sorry, to yeah, yeah. sorry to interrupt yeah, yeah. You. Uh, so do you have any, mm -hmm. any any experience in other bpm tools apart from apn no 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 like ibm uh, bpm or maybe uh, pega uh, after completion of my video i just landed on apn also. hello yeah, hello yes we can yeah, yeah. somebody yeah yeah yeah, as I mentioned, what is BPM? Uh, the, the continuation of this BPM slide is this part. And what is Appian? Just now I said, while coming to this Appian, like, you know, uh, uh, before building an application, we will be building an application with the sum of the objects in the uh, Appian by using these objects. Like, you know, in this, uh, uh, in Appian, we'll be having different types of objects like data type, uh, data store, record the process model, process report interfaces report site constant decision expression tool and while coming to if you want to integrate our uh, uh, like you know if you want to integrate app in with the uh, other systems then we will go with an integration parts and we'll be having groups and connector systems and data type and data type, data type in the sense cdd and we'll be having the constants and expression rules and interfaces reports and sites everything will be we can configure in Appian. Uh, 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 like you know, you people will be having doubt. Like we, uh, we are having different type of uh, languages. Why we have to make use of this? Uh, things. 
by using this appian uh, by using this appian tool we can make the project uh, we can handle the project within the short time and it is a cost effective where we will be supporting uh, the project from the back end from the from the front end we will be integrating our application will be integrated with the java and those uh, android for the user friendly where we will be supporting uh, from the back end okay we are well coming to the technologies like you know java uh, java python and some other they will be having the uh, lines of code very huge amount of lines of code but while coming to the app and like you know there will be some sustain sustain in the sense will be having limited uh, limited code based upon the requirement will be will be doing coding uh, as per the app in standards and the app in coding Uh, that's it from my side. Hello.